Today I'm sharing cleaning shortcuts that actually work. These work for me, so I wanna pass them along. Cleaning can be totally time consuming, it can be tedious, it can be a chore. I think that cleaning does not have to be tedious. I think you can get it done easily and quickly. I think it can become part of a routine. You simply need some shortcuts, and I know I'm using the word shortcut. It's not really a shortcut, it's just an easier way to get it done. If you wanna save time and effort, come along with me today, and I'm gonna give you some tips and tricks. I'm gonna show you the shortcuts that work for me. Okay, the first is hacks. If you've watched my channel, you know I love hacks. Some people think maybe a hack is like something skirting around what you're actually trying to get done. It is not the case. It, a hack is simply anything that allows you to accomplish a familiar task more easily and efficiently. One of the things I love to do is to use my dishwasher to clean not just dishes. So some of the things I'll put in my dishwasher that maybe you don't expect that they can go into the dishwasher are things like your light covers that go on your light fixtures. You can put your oven, microwave, exhaust fan filters right in there. I've seen a lot of hacks that involve pouring boiling water. I've tried it, it doesn't work. I simply stick it in the dishwasher and that gets all of the grease right off. You can put your toothbrush holders in there. You can put your shower caddies. You can put silicone baking items like your silicone oven trays or if you have any oven mitts. You can put sponges. I use the Scrub Daddy sponges. Those come out really well in the dishwasher. And if you've got small items that you wanna wash in the dishwasher like kids toys, you just stick them in a mesh laundry bag, throw them on the top rack, and they will come out sparkling. I also like to use a hack to clean my blinds. I will just stick an athletic sock turned inside out on my hand. That works really well to clean blinds. I also use squeegees on windows and showers, and especially using that squeegee daily in the shower keeps it really clean. Or speaking of shower, cleaning the shower while you're in it. That is also a great hack. So remember, hacks can be great and they can really help you save a lot of time and be a super cleaning shortcut. Okay, another shortcut is multitasking. Multitasking, but not in a bad way. I love cleaning multiple things at once so that it saves me time. So if I'm going to the trouble of wiping down my front of my fridge, then I've got my product out, I've got my microfiber cloth out, I'm just gonna also wipe down the dishwasher and maybe I'm even gonna wipe down a cabinet or two and just kind of spot clean it. So instead of going into it thinking, okay, I'm just gonna wipe down this fridge and put this all away, just see if there's a couple other things. If you've got the time, just do it and it's done. Same thing with like your floors. If you get your mop out, don't just mop the kitchen floor. Mop all of your floors. You've already gone to the trouble of getting the mop out, getting the water, putting your cleaner into it. So might as well just multitask and get a little bit more done. If you're wiping out your kitchen sink, do the counter as well. Other things I like to do when I'm multitasking, like if I'm giving the kids a bath, I'll actually clean the bathroom while they're in the tub. That way the bathroom gets clean and I can continue to hang out with them and keep an eye on them. Or while I'm standing in the microwave and I'm heating up my food, I will go ahead and empty the dishwasher. I've timed it. I can empty the dishwasher at a leisurely pace in about four minutes, and that's about how long the food takes. So I'm kind of getting this these two things done and multitasking. Okay, and now another shortcut involves room-specific shortcuts, and I'm gonna give you some ideas for these, but they are specific shortcuts that you can do in each room of your home that will make things faster. In the kitchen, one of the shortcuts you can do is to clean as you cook. Instead of cooking your dinner and then having a big messed up kitchen, you can just go ahead and clean while you cook, while you're waiting for the next step in your cooking process, just clean a dish or put your spices away that you've been using or wipe down the counter. That will really save you time. Or if you're washing your dishes, another hack in the kitchen that I like to do is I just let my dishes air dry rather than drying them with a towel. I find that that saves me time. I'm not spending time drying them and they're just sitting there drying on their own. Okay, so in the bathroom, some room specific hacks there. Toss your shower curtain and your bath mats and your rugs, just toss those right into the washing machine. Put some toilet bowl cleaner into your toilet before you go to bed and when you wake up in the morning, you can clean it. Another thing I love to do in the bathroom, if I'm brushing my teeth, then when I'm finished, I will just take like a soapy hand and kind of clean out my sink in the bathroom. That will keep it looking clean and neat and it literally is just a very quick room specific shortcut that I can take. I'm not cleaning the whole sink, I am just doing it quickly after I've brushed my teeth. And then my final kind of shortcut tip here is to invest in time saving cleaning products. 
and cleaning tools. If you are using the wrong tool for the job, it just is so much harder, it takes so much longer, it's such an effort. If you just get the right tools and the right products, you will save yourself a ton of time. Some tools I recommend. So if you've got toilet stains, just get the Pummy Scouring Stick. Those will take the stains right off. It will make your toilet look sparkling clean, it does not scratch it, and it is a very quick way to have a clean toilet. I love using magic erasers. These work so well in the bathroom. You can use them in your tubs, you can use them in your sinks, on your walls. They have a ton of uses. I did a whole video on it that you can watch after this one. Magic erasers are a great tool to cut down on time and scrubbing. I like to also use like tablets to clean out my dishwasher. A fresh makes these great dishwasher cleaning tablets. Those will keep your dishes really clean and it will clean out your dish dishwasher. Or microfiber towels. I like to use these cloths instead of paper towels. It creates less waste. You only need a couple for your entire house, but they're very absorbent. They trap dust and dirt. And in a lot of instances, you can simply clean a surface with just water. You could also get a steam cleaner or a spin brush. These are just some ideas of tools that will really help you to save time and, they, and could be considered a cleaning shortcut. So those are my ideas on cleaning shortcuts. I hope that they helped you as much as they helped me. I'm gonna continue to look for shortcuts and hacks and bring them to you because people don't wanna spend a lot of time cleaning. I love cleaning, but I also don't wanna spend my entire life cleaning. So I'm always looking for ways to make it more efficient, but like in a practical way. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna link another one. Go ahead and click on it and I will see you over there. Thanks for watching.